sitting at the at the Vanier Cup uh, game, I, I was struck by how many of the students had come out to support the team and what uh, obvious pride they, they were showing in the institution. And that's been a high point for me to see uh, whether it's the roads, whether it's uh, the uh, Vanier, whether it's some remarkable new research achievement uh, from our faculty, uh, all of these things have fed into a growing sense of institutional pride this year. It was again uh, a remarkable year in terms of uh, philanthropic gifts to the university. The Boris gift uh, this year, which will see $30 million go towards uh, stem cell therapies, uh, and uh, uh, Suzanne Labarge's gift on uh, optimal aging. Uh, these are quite remarkable and uh, like so many of our major gifts in the past, they will transform this institution in the coming year. The Downtown uh, uh, Health Centre is a really, really remarkable project and very gratifying to see it uh, uh, r towards the end of the year brought to this wonderful stage at which we were able to uh, turn the first sod and begin the uh, the construction of the building. So we can look ahead to times that will be very different from uh, the present to our immediate past, but I, I would say based on this year I have immense confidence in the university and its future. I think we are uh, as well situated as any university and considerably better situated than most to address some of the changes that we're going to need to make and to make changes that reinforce our mission that speak to our historic and strategic strengths. So I'm very, very optimistic about the coming year.